In this week's Above the Terror Line, I'd like to discuss how the federal law enforcement and intelligence community respond behind the scenes when a suspicious murder occurs inside the United States with potential international links. On the night of January 17, 2012, an Iranian woman by the name of Galarha Bagherzadeh was murdered in Texas. The 30-year-old single woman was shot while driving near her home in Houston. Media reports allege that Bagherzadeh was tied to Iranian opposition groups. Whether that is accurate or not is unknown to Stratfor. However, we do understand that the killing has crossed the threshold into the kind of murder that raises the interest of the counterterrorism community in Washington. The Houston Police Department Homicide Division is in charge of the investigation. They will be looking to answer the who, what, when, where, how, and why in an effort to determine motive for the murder. The motive could involve robbery, a love triangle, a family dispute, or it could just be a random crime. While the Houston Police Department conducts their investigation, the FBI will take the lead in conducting a parallel investigation to determine if there was a foreign hand in the murder. The victims alleged anti-Iranian activities have drawn the attention of several U.S. government agencies because of the plot to kill a California-based spokesman of an Iranian opposition movement and the recently uncovered IRGC plot to kill the Saudi ambassador of the United States. Given the possibility of foreign involvement in the murder, FBI headquarters and the CIA will be quietly assisting the Joint Terrorism Task Force in Houston to help solve the case. The Houston JTTF will be collecting and reviewing highly classified intelligence reports and assessments on Iran from inside the Beltway. A range of international inquiries will also move forward quietly. The CIA, the State Department, and FBI headquarters will be working with liaison counterparts from foreign intelligence agencies like the British MI5 and MI6 to generate leads about the murder. Foreign sources will be tasked with intelligence collection requirements. The travel patterns and movements of known Iranian intelligence officers, known as IOs, will be evaluated. NSA and the British GCHQ intercepts will be reviewed, and previous Iranian-backed assassinations will be studied. It is also not unusual for Iranian defectors or agents in place to be asked to comment about what happened. Very quietly, the analysts in D.C. will reconstruct the victim's life in an effort to produce leads and figure out what happened. What's the above the tear line aspect of this video? At the end of the day, this may be nothing more than an act of random crime or family violence. However, the feds will be looking globally for evidence to determine if a political assassination happened on the streets of Houston, Texas. I have little doubt that if an Iranian hand was in play, the U.S. government will be able to figure it out.